Today I came across a solution for the 12VH PWR connectors on 40 series video cards that will prevent them from melting. I came across PC World's video. Let me show you quick. MSI has created a cable with a yellow tip to ensure that when you plug in the cable, it's plugged in all the way. You can tell if that cable is plugged in all the way or if the cable is not plugged in all the way. If you look at some photos here, a cable that is fully plugged in, you're not going to be able to see the yellow part of the cable, but a cable that's not fully plugged in, you're going to be able to tell if that cable is not fully plugged in. And that's the solution for the 12 VH PWR melting connectors on the 40 series graphics cards. Now that's amazing. It's awesome that MSI is going the distance to make the tips of the cables yellow so that when you plug in the cable, you're going to be able to tell if that cable is fully plugged in or not fully plugged in. And I even watched the video that PC World released, I think, today. Right there. Let's take a look at the video and then we'll comment. I'm going to take a fully black cable, which is what you usually see. I'm going to plug it into the power supply to simulate what's plugged in the power supply or GPU. So it's plugged in, it's locked in. But let me just kind of wiggle it a little bit. Honestly, is that fully seated or not fully seated? I would say that cable should probably be pushed in again, but honestly, when this is buried in the guts of your case and you've been pulling on this cable to make it nice and neat, you can see that you might be able to get that one and a half millimeters out and you wouldn't be able to tell because the connector is all black on black on black. I mean, he's showing you the original black cable when it's plugged in and he's wiggling that cable left and right like there's no tomorrow. And he's telling you, you might have a gap, even though the cable looks seated, you may have a gap. Now let's do this again with the yellow to show you how cool this is. So again, out, take our yellow cable, push it in, fully seated, unseated. Right? That's just enough gap that I probably would want to push it in. I hope you noticed what happened in this part of the video. He connected the yellow tip cable all the way to a point where you do not see the yellow part anymore. That ensures that the cable is connected all the way. Great. Awesome. I love it. But as soon as he touched that cable, you are able to see that yellow part again. And that proves that even when that cable is connected in all the way, because of the tolerance and error margin on that connector, you can still move that cable left and right and by moving the cable left or right that will create resistance heat melted connector and now when you send in the card for warranty they're going to blame it on the user you did not connect the cable in all the way and you still have people saying it's a user error and nothing to do with the card or the connector but that's a 100 percent proof that even when that cable is connected all the way and you move that cable you're going to have that gap on the cable you have a clip on the front the connector connects from the front you do not have clips from the side so there's still room for that cable to move. If you notice the user in the video, when he was wiggling the black cable left and right, left and right, left and right, even though that cable was all the way in, he told you that because it's black on black, you're not going to be able to see if there's a gap. And he was putting a lot of pressure on that cable. But when it came to that yellow connector cable, he just put a slight pressure on it. And then you were able to see that yellow part. And he told you that's a gap that he would not worry about pushing back in. Why the double standards? You are a person that is reviewing that cable. Just be honest in the way you review that cable. You did see that yellow part. What's the purpose of the cable? What's the purpose of that yellow part of the cable if it's not for not being able to see that yellow part anymore? Any slight movement on that cable will show you that yellow part. So the cable is not fully connected, even though that cable is fully connected. The same goes for the black cable. Even though it's fully connected, any gap in that connector the way the cable is plugged in, even though the cable is fully plugged in, we're going to blame it on the user? No, it's 100%, 200%, not a user problem. In the past, we never had to worry about this. We connect the cable until it clicks, done. But now, every time we go inside our PC to clean, we have to worry. Did we touch that cable? Did that cable come loose from the sides? We always have to monitor that yellow part, assuming that you have that yellow colored tip. You have to keep looking. Do I see yellow? Or, or whatever the case may be. Why? Is that realistic? Did we come that far where we always have to keep looking over our cable even though the cable is fully plugged in? I'll leave a link for PC World's video down below. 
watch the video and let them know how you feel. I just wanted to go over this video quick. Let me know what you think. Leave it down in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll do something else in the next video.